Okay, this is a demonstration of using two um, wireless RF transceiver that I got from sureelectronic.net. So, but before you start hooking up the hardware, you need to get the software, or unless you want to use the hyper terminal, but this is a much better way to uh, interface with the UART. So on this um, Microsoft website, to give you the source code for C++, and you can use uh, Visual Studio to compile it, and you can use that as a uh, an interface to do serial chatting. So let's let's take a look at the hardware now. Okay, this is the RF receiver at one end. It has seven pins. Well, the first one is the ground, or well, the next one is the VCC. Goes from you can take 3.3 volts or 5 volts. The next one is the enable, must be high to be used. The next one is the UART receiver, it goes in. The next one is the UART transmitter. So this is uh, the the line where the RF transceiver transmit data to the computer to be displayed on the hyper terminal. And the last two pin is used for the RS232 where you just ground it if you want to use UART. And that's basically the setup for the uh, transceiver. You can do the same for the other end. So here I have my my UART wire from the NERD kit. Basically connect that into the UART pins. Make sure you have the same ground. Once you turn on, it should be ready to go. But let's take a look at the um, the terminal, the serial chat I was talking about. So this is uh, compiled using the Visual C++. And when, once you open it, it shows you the available ports. And you just click on the right port, choose that, and the serial bar rate for the transceiver is default at 9. 9600 says enter the rest is default 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 and the last line asks you for the name similar to the way you would do on an online chat so I would say this one is uh, Windows Windows 7 so this will be our name now from this side in the transmitter is Windows 7. Okay. Now, so the power is on now. Let's go to the other end. Okay. So, on this side, I have a similar setup I've ever seen in the other room using the same module. Same setup using the UART wire from their kit. And I'm using 3.3 volts power source. And open up the serial chat and click on the right COM port. Now I named this one as a Vista. So here I'm going to send a message to my Windows 7 computer and say hello. Windows 7 my name is Kelvin and press enter once you press enter that will send the data to the UART cable and that will be transmitted by the RF module let's go take a look on the other side And it's to receive on this end, and that's pretty sweet because this is a total of 30, 30 bucks, and you get two modules. 
So that's the end of the short tutorial. You can send back. Hello, Vista. And of course, on the end, you see the same thing.